Hi guys, this is Scott Harmer with Motorsportsland in Salt Lake City. Today we're going to take a look at a brand new 2014 Zinger 250 Bunkhouse. It's a neat trailer, it's a half ton towable trailer but still in a fifth wheel so it really gives you that added extra space. Um, coming from the front, let's take, kind of take a look. We've got the twin 30 pound propane bottles, automatically switch over if they do run out of gas as long as both tanks are open. Nice that you opted on these to have You've got an actual fiberglass front cap. That's kind of what takes all, all the abuse, you know, while you're on the road, all the wind hits that and is dispersed, if you know, for better, you know, air fuel economy. Up front, you've got a great storage. It's able to house a generator. It's all sealed in. It's all got lighting on it. Separate battery containers on the far side of that. Coming around the front, they've even got little things on these trailers, like a three inch drain spout, just so it kicks the water out away from the trailer, not running down, leaving a, a black mark and having the chance to have water go in the trailer. Um, your hot water heater is gas or electric, so if you're at a campground, just turn it on to the electric power and don't have to use your propane for that. Also nice things like a gravity water fill, so you don't have to have a pressure water fill to fill the, the trailer itself. So if you're gonna be gone for you know extended period of time, thinking you may run out of water, you can bring a little bit extra with you, but then you're maintaining your regular city water connection if you're out of area, you don't have to use your pump. You'll notice a nice deep slide, wide super slide on these that houses your, your sofa and your dinette, coming out really nice and deep. Rack and pinion slide system, so it's really nice and secure and durable as well. Uh, the Zinger 250 has a 30 amp service here, which is nice, it goes into the trailer, keeping the cord out of the way. Hot cold shower here on the back, fully walkable roof, integrated ladder going up to the top. You've got a, a campsite door here coming into your, your, your bunk beds. You can flip that up if you have uh, high stuff to store, bikes, whatnot, but it's just a really nice storage area so you can take stuff right from the campsite, whether it's camp chairs or lawn chairs or barbecues, just to keep it right up front here. This trailer's also opted with the electric awning. You'll notice it's got a nice row of LED lights too that really shine up the campsite. Chrome caps on your wheels. Zingers have a secure stance on their axles, so you've got 16 inches in between tires. It distributes the weight a lot more evenly, gives you a lot better ride. Also nitrogen filled tires. As well, this trailer is opted with the PolarTech upgraded um, insulation system. It also has a heated and enclosed underbelly so you can use it all year round. Nice big handle going into the entry. Come on inside, we'll take a look. As soon as you walk in, you can definitely get a, a bit, lot, lot lighter feel of the trailer. You've got a really great Nice skylight that really lightens up the main area, especially when you're out in a natural sunlight situation. Solid surface countertops, big double stainless steel sinks. You've got a, a bifold on the top of your stove top just to give you more countertop space with an integrated knife storage in here. You'll notice also all solid surface, high, you know, the raised panel cabinetry. Everything is built really nice with gas shocks. Nor cold refrigerator. Separate freezer with a nice deep bin. Double bunk beds, each having their own light. Coming into the bathroom, you've got the nice foot flush on the toilet, nice big sink, vanity. A lot of your bunk houses will also be opted to have the tub with the curtain across, just because you've usually got kids, a lot easier to bathe in a tub. Really great storage pantry wise throughout. You've got ducted air conditioning that keeps the entire trailer the same temperature, as well as ducted heating in the floor. That's your, in your enclosed underbelly as well. You've got an oversized dinette with full length drawers. So nobody has to get up to get anything out of the drawers. So if you're actually an adult couple, you know, it's big enough that four, four adults can sit and not be, you know, rubbing knees and elbows. One of the greatest things about this trailer, 
The zinger from Crossroads is if you ever have a second couple come with you or just larger kids, instead of a, you know, a regular drop down sofa, this is an actual fold out trifold bed. Really easy to set up and down. The pillows go back on top to finish it off. It's just a really, really nice, easy, actual real bed that you can stay in. Um, the Zinger's got an area big enough for a 32 inch TV. It's also got the new Jensen AM FM CD DVD player. So you can put a movie in, listen to it on the surround sound system and watch it on the TV system. It's got a great coat closet where you want a coat closet right by the door. Nice, big and deep. And just more storage everywhere you can fit it. Coming up into the bedroom, you've got a Divider curtain to give you some privacy. Another area large enough for a 32 inch here, pre-wired everything in. More storage. You've got hanging lockers on the side. Top cabinets over top. Queen size bed, walk around with great storage underneath. Really a great utilization of storage everywhere that it can be. Everything raised panel, solid, sir, solid gas shocks. All right, well, thank you for taking a look at the new Zinger 250 Bunkhouse 2004. I'm Scott Harmer with Motorsportsland in Salt Lake City.